Jason Mraz is an acclaimed <laughs> singer. He's a songwriter, two-time Grammy winner, whose hit song, I'm Yours, surpassed one billion what? streams on Spotify. I'm not even no. surprised. Yeah. Well, today, y'all, he's ours for the morning. <laughs> and he's out with his eighth studio album. It's called Mystical, Magical, Rhythmical, Radical Ride. Love it. Come on, Jason. Yeah. The name. The name. The well, name. It's life. <laughs> this life is a mystical, magical, rhythmical, radical ride. You know, it, it's important for us to to be mystified by it and be grateful and enjoy the ride. Well, and that's what this yeah. album, yeah. your eighth one, is all about. It's yeah. just loving life. Yeah. I try to write songs that cheer me on. I love Cheryl's outlook, but y'all were yeah. just sharing. And I try to do the same with my music. I want to write songs that cheer us on, stoke the fires of love, presence, gratitude, so that we can enjoy this life. Where are you at this stage in your life? Because we've interviewed you over yeah. the years. I don't know. I feel like I'm just getting started. <laughs> really? Yeah, I really do. Yeah. Describe that. like. Well, um, you know, sometimes when you create something, you're inventing something out of nothing. So it's just an invention. Right. And then you don't really know what that is. But now after eight albums, I feel I have a little bit more experience. And now I feel like I, I'm ready to, to be of service. You oh, know, that's interesting. With my songs. That's yeah. beautiful. And but I'm just getting started. In as that, right? you yeah. were writing this album, I, your, your, your mother was sick, yeah. Yeah. right? And you lost your stepfather. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So how did that impact what, what we'll hear? You know, um, it's happening, a lot of people my age, yeah. 40s, 50s, yeah. you, I wasn't prepared for that. Like mm -hmm. this is the years we start to take care of our parents. And so that, that really presenced um, just how precious time is. Mm -hmm. And we're really seeing it on tour and we can acknowledge our, our guests in the house to really enjoy the time they're spending with their loved ones at the concert because mm -hmm. that's really what concerts are all about. Totally. Yeah. Willie Nelson is one of your faves. Yes. Me too. And yeah. he's an inspiration yeah. to you and yeah. you got to spend some time with him. Yeah. What was that, what was that like for you? So he and I've spent many hours with Willie and he's the best and He's probably in his late 80s the last time we hung out, and all he wanted to do was play me new songs that he's written. New songs. New songs. What do you so, say, Jason? I got one? That's one. what he's like. You want to hear a couple of new songs I just recorded? <laughs> I'm like, definitely. Let's go. And all we do is just sit and listen to music. And what that told me was that I'm never going to stop, uh -huh. right? No matter what age I think I'm going to retire, why would I give up music? Why would I give up my gift? And Willie is demonstrating that he's not giving up his. You know, In fact, he's sharing it through his entire life. Mm. Oh, find love and give it away. Mm -hmm. It's everywhere. <laughs> yeah. um, okay, you also harvest avocados and coffee. You're a farmer, that's another thing. I what know, are you doing? I have too many jobs. What are you doing? And you what sell your I avocados doing? to Chipotle? It's true. Who are you? What it's do you eat true. at Chipotle? Uh, mostly guac. <laughs> yeah, I just want the guac. <laughs> Me too. Uh, yeah. yeah. And the queso too, yeah. if, if they have it. Yeah. Well, we um, can't wait to hear you sing. Thanks. So Excited what are you going to be singing for us when we head down? It's called Feel Good Too. That's what Feel we need. Feel Good Too. Yeah. We're right. into it. Yeah.